You play to win. People, Mark Holmes here. And as always, I want to say thank you all for watching, commenting, subscribing, and being part of the Joe Boo Sports Report. Without you guys and you ladies, you know that this literally does not work. Oh, my goodness. Things are heating up on the Cowboys. Man. Oh, my goodness. Things are heating up. Oh, man. The Cowboys are getting to work right now. Right now. They, I'm, I'm telling you. Oh, my God. They're hard, hard at it. They've just had a big. No, no, no. Not a big. A huge, huge signing. They are truly all in. Oh, my. Oh, man. This is just the start of a lot of great things. That the Cowboys are going to be doing, and and let, let let's see if we got this you know straighten this out now because we know that they, they they're interested in maybe bringing back Tony Pollard and everything. Uh, Tony Pollard's interested in coming back, even you know maybe take a a little bit of a home team discount. They have yet to talk to Dak Prescott about his contract or CD Lamb, and they kind of. Um, although I will change the narrative a little bit here uh, with Micah Parsons. They have signed him as a defensive end, which is about two and a half million dollars less than what a linebacker would be. And um, I will actually tell you something that's interesting that I don't think anybody else has told you about. But here's what's interesting. Here's what's interesting. If we go by this year's franchise tag numbers, okay, just follow me for a second here. Um, linebacker franchise tag number is 24 million dollars defensive end is 21 and so we all looked at that and said oh my goodness he's gonna file a grievance oh they shortchanged him money because i kept thinking i would think a defensive end pass rush would be more than a linebacker but i was like okay but what do i know i'm a guy with a day job and a voodoo doll who's fortunate that i'm not broadcasting from my mama's basement but here's what's interesting is the projected franchise tag for 2025 Check this out. Defensive end, $27.4 million. Linebacker, $24.647. So, in actual, the fifth-year option for Micah Parsons being a defensive end is $3 million more than it is for linebacker in 25. So the price tag is going up. The price tag is going up. Now, maybe that has no effect because they're looking at the number that it is right now, but I'm still kind of confused on that. But either way, they look at it. Here's the way they look at it is they'll negotiate a new contract. And by that, the number is more valuable for an edge rusher as opposed to an outside, to a linebacker. Anyway, back to the breaking news. The Cowboys with the big, oh, my God, it's huge, signing. Are you, are you, are you ready? Are you ready for it? Are you ready? The Dallas Cowboys have signed. Drum roll, please. Carl Davis. You're like, who? Carl Davis. Carl Davis? Carl Davis, who was with the Ravens. Who was with the, with the Cleveland Browns in 2018? Who was with the Tampa Bay? I'm sorry, two teams. Indianapolis and Jacksonville Jaguars. In 2020 through 22. He was with New England. And last year, last year, he was with the Dallas Cowboys. Nose tackle, Carl Davis, who had three assists last year. Three assists. And in his career, he's had 68 combined tackles, 35 solos, five tackles for a loss, Three quarterback hits and two and a half sacks. But when I say he's big, Carl Davis is six foot five, three hundred and thirty-five pounds, 
and 32 years of age. Shout out to the Dallas Cowboys for finally making a move. Making a move. I, I should open up the bottle of rum and take a taste because the Cowboys have shown some signs of life. Yeah, it's Slim Pickens. But I'll take what I can get. Now, I, I'll, just, I'll just take what I can get at this point, okay? So that's where we are. We're the Dallas Cowboys. Of course we say we're all in. And uh, uh, they literally put you to sleep because you're just waiting for something to happen. Just waiting for something to happen. Anything. And then we get Carl Davis. So, yeah. That's all I got for you. Sorry. I wish there were more. But that's all I got. All right, good people. Appreciate you. Peace out.